All right, well, good morning. Today uh, we're doing a food tour for lunch. So gonna try out several different specialties from Lyon and with a guide and uh, hopefully they can show us all around the uh, old city, eating our way through it. Let's get going. You can get about everything that you need in Lyon, including the ladies underwear booth. Passionata. All the Viking riverboat cruisers. All right, time for a coffee. Always time for a coffee. And no set this time. Okay, we're starting back at the Place du Chant. Place of Change. Place of where they actually did trade money here, so they would trade money for all their goods. And as they were making the deals and stuff, if they didn't have enough money for the deals, the, all the table that they were trading across, they would crunch in half, and that would mean you were bankrupt. Little Hearts by the artist MMM. Oh, so we just found out the author from the Petit Prince is from uh, Lyon. This is the most translated book after the Bible in over 200 languages. Well, let's see. Okay. Quiz Baba Chow became quite well known. So we're going to talk about next. Exactly. This here is Guignol. All right, that is because Everyone can bear with me. All right, this is our first food stop right here. It's time for a little shakutar. Cows were making butter, milk. Cooked flesh is pretty ironic, considering that raw ham and jambon sec. Jambon sec. This is going to be the preserved for more than four months. Saint Marcelin cheese. So it's kind of creamy on the, the inside rosette. here. And this is from and Cote de Rhone for the wine. Of course, most people will eat the crust. Okay. Uh, Gritty cheese is called Cervan something. It's like silk workers' brains. It kind of looks like it. All right, that was a good charcuterie. Uh, tasting there had different cheeses different including uh soap worker brains and uh in the place du gouvernement at uh, chez mami <laughs> we should do this every day le bichon, le bichon. <laughs> Now, a little bit later in history, we'll be having our goûter, our sweet snack. We found the source of the pink pralines that we're making our creme brulee pink. Boyers well, figures, like if they were putting these flowers into the soap, they probably needed to know what they looked like. Found a secret trabou. We just pushed the button and went right in. Oh, there's the backside of the patisserie. Oh, look at that. This well has since been covered up, but this shows that you know, these people were getting their water from these river sources, which if you've looked at them, they're not very clean. <laughs> it's the other side. Cool. If it opens, if it goes through to a courtyard, you know that you're in a triple. If it's locked or if it just goes into an empty space, you have not. <laughs> I'm making the chartreuse stop in the window there. You can also buy the liquor of Chartreuse, which is a concentrated liquor. It's, if I'm not mistaken, around 72%. Oh. I recently tried it. You only want a tiny, tiny. It's a, chartreuse is an herbal blend made by monks to purify the water, but um, it was uh, only two monks know the uh, secret recipe, kind of like Pim's number two, or maybe Pim's number one.
of beef. <laughs> Love the street of beef. There's a last little bit about if you want to try really great food, Michelin rated food, but not pay a lot, you can go to the food trouble that uh, we saw on the first day we were here with all the little shops and restaurants in them. taking our lunch order and she's describing the tripe doing her best but it still sounds terrible number two is fried beef stomach yeah boudin boudin looks pretty good we have that in louisiana a soccer game going on in the transept. It's not on our food tour. American sandwich. are making different types of food and they have different specialties. So in a brasserie, like the brasserie George has suggested, we are brassing or making beer and that is what would be served. Okay, Expo, this is about... It's like uh, it's like bulla bulla or whatever bull, and they're drinking these barrels of Ricard, which is like a, a summer drink that you can dilute with water if you want or uh, or not. There's a few student-run restaurants in the city, and this cafe is one of them, Bactel Gourmet. It's run by uh, the culinary students. One of the things they have to do before they uh, get out of school or graduate is actually be the manager and operate uh, one of the local restaurants. Our last stop, Noisette. And technically, you're not supposed to walk with coffee in Lyon. You're supposed to sit down and enjoy it at a cafe, but uh, we're going to go carry it and sit down and enjoy it. Here's a little marzipan chocolate for dessert from Voisin. There's a little bit interesting bit of French language history. There's a little hat that goes over letters and uh, that's called an accent or something like that. And I think what that means is that there's the languages or the words been changed so that there's a letter missing now. So like hotel and hostel are two examples. Yeah, these are actually lists of all the people who've donated to the uh, to the hospital. So there's some big amounts. So it's not anonymous. They just put their name up and how much they donated for <laughs> perpetuity. Okay, that was a food tour. That was excellent. That was pretty good. So yeah, so the charcuterie, um, number one. Number two was a praline, yeah, a little praline cake. Number three was the main course, like a main course that we had that um that and we had some weird stuff boudin and then uh also like a fish with crawfish sauce a, a fish like souffle a fish, like a, yes a fish souffle yeah and then we had uh then we had a coffee for dessert at the end so i would say that was pretty good i would do that a tour like that again it was nice having someone set all that up and you didn't have to worry about uh planning or fooding exactly yeah we got a lot of history like, because the food is tied to history. So it made it really nice. And then, you know, learned some language skills, too. Yeah. So cool. All right. Excellent job. Who was that again? That was what company was that? Uh, so the, I don't know the company. 
but the program that I went through is called Get Your Guide. Yeah, we Get Your Guide. We went so through far, them. That was so pretty easy. That was for our boat tour and for this food tour, and both of them were super awesome. Very cool. What's not to like about Leon? If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe.